Greetings and salutations, gamers. This is Lies85 with episode 24 of Let's Play Legend of Zelda Ocarina of Time with DKS3A. And we're still in the Forest Temple. Let's go through this door. Oh my god, it's another twist. Oh my god. Watch for the shadows of monsters that hang from the ceiling. It looks like an Escher yes. painting. <laughs> oh. It looks like an Escher painting. But anyway, we uh, went through, uh, after a couple of failures, we went through a couple of rooms, and uh, it was a green bubble. Green bubble, use his sword when his green fire vanishes. How about this? But, uh, <laughs> but afterward, we finally got the bow and arrow, and we continued through the fourth temple, and, and we got first of the two of the four poses. And, uh, yep. Yeah. Go through there. Go through that door. We got another key. So let's go through there. And it should lead us to the flaming arrow room. Alright, so what we got to do here is oh my god, that, 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 that's not what we needed to do. Thank you, sir. That is not what we needed to do. What we need to do here, there's four rotating platforms. You notice there's a uh, a switch there, an eye, a silver eye, <laughs> silver eye, <laughs> uh, sitting there with ice encased around it. What we got to do is go over here where the fire's at, go between the fire and the silver eye, <laughs> silver eye. I don't get it. It's from Sir Rod, but but uh, he but he always says Golden Eye. He goes Golden Eye, <laughs> Golden Eye. But there's no Golden Eye. I'm just going Silver Eye. <laughs> it's Sir Rod. It's more Sir Rod stuff. But uh, basically, we got to shoot an arrow through the fire, or through the fire, and hit the ice. Through the fire and flames. Daniel has nightmares from that song. I've beaten it in expert mode, but I still get some nightmares. <laughs> he gets like, no more, no more. Go up in a fetal position. Uh, Damn. I suck. No, it's not you, it's Link. Link, you're supposed to be an expert archer, right? I just got this shit, so fuck off. Excuse me. Well, we, uh, well, uh, uh. Well, you're supposed to be a jack of all trades. You're supposed to be able to pick up anything immediately and be able to use it immediately. Ah, Link! Link! Come on, it's not that difficult, Link. Wait, why am I trying to do this? I got something else. That I do. Okay. It's cheap. Oh, then fire. <laughs> oh, yeah. Yes! Yes! Yeah! Then's fire. What the? What? <laughs> now we got. Nope, oh, there it goes. And it makes the hallway. Twist! Twist! Let's do the twist. I can't believe I'm waiting some time. Yeah. I forgot about that too, so don't feel bad. Your guy sucks, DK. I want to told you about Dings Fire. <laughs> so now, the hallway's all twisty. But uh, now, we gotta wait for. Uh, the runner well right for the wall master of all things. Come on, wall master, where are you? There it comes. See, here comes the shadow of the wall master. Oh, by the way, if the wall master grabs you, all the way back to the beginning. He sends you all the way back to the beginning of the realm of the whole dungeon. And now we just gotta drop down, drop down the pit. Drop down the pit. Found the hole. And now we're gonna head through here, and this is called the crushing ceiling room. You see why it's called a crushing ceiling room? 
Uh, there's a ceiling. It, oh yeah, that's what happens. It's going to crush you. There we go. We gotta get to that switch over there. Oh, ball's gone. Which unlocks the door, but there's also something else we can get. Yeah, it's right there at that chest. Oh! Yeah! <laughs> oh, look at you, We don't have to get the chest. I mean, I don't think there's anything important, but... I don't think it's in Not a... not a... It's not a key. Oh, it's gonna suck, it's gonna suck! Oh! We might as well get the... I think it's gonna be upside. What's in this chest? Better so good. Arrows! Ah! Really? Arrows? Yeah, you can't hop on the phone, so, so doors open. So now we can go through here, and now we're in the puzzle block room. Why, why is it called that? Look up there, there's a bunch of puzzle blocks. But what is it, how we get to those puzzle blocks? Oh, look, there's another Poe right there. Now we get to shoot, we shoot the portrait and the puzzle block fall down, and now we gotta make a picture of the Poe using these puzzle blocks. And you have a minute to do it. And if you don't do it within a minute, the puzzle will kind of reset itself. You have to do it all over again. So we gotta do this kind of quick. Screwed up there. We're gonna have to reset the puzzle. One of the uh, one of the pieces we won't have to use. Yeah. So now the puzzle resets itself. We get a ten extra seconds though. And now we get to do is all over again. Yeah, that big black puzzle piece is not does not belong. Mm -hmm. Let's move that out of the way. Let's use these other four to uh, get it together. Uh, so much fun. Isn't this fun, Link? No. It's a fucking game. Seriously, I just hate to climb. I told you to grab. Uh, Yes, we're going to be cutting it kind of close, but I think we can do it. we be really close. Uh, I don't think we're going to do it this time, guys. Yeah, they're going to reset on us. Alright, so here it goes again. At least the one that we don't need is already out of the way, so we just gotta rearrange it again. And add in another 10 seconds, now we got a minute and 20. <laughs> Alright. This is gonna buy, uh, I think we got it this time. We got it this time. Move this one over here. There we go. And then move this one right here. All right. And we got it. 
and I make the green Poe appear. And what's this Poe's name? Amy! This is Amy. Amy! Okay. Oh! Alright, this one's gonna be a deck. Nah, I got my boat too late. Boom! Alright, just kind of chill here. Same thing as the other two poses since we fought so far. When she appears, shoot it with an arrow. Every time she disappears, he breaks the, she breaks the Z target, so you gotta re, re Z target her. Okay. <laughs> Alright. Come on, guys. We can do this. And that takes care of that one. And the third post sis has been defeated, and her flame returns. All right, so the fourth, the the third of the four, a third of the post sisters is gone. So let's go through this newly opened door. And we got another Skulltola. Really? It vaporized. It hurts. So now we're going to be headed back to the torch room, the original room. All right. All right. So now notice three of the four flames are back in place. So how we do this fourth flame? Let's go down here to this floor and look. There's. Oh my god, what's going on? What is going on? She splits into four! This one's a little bit different. You gotta find you gotta find a real one. And the only way you can find a real one is the Z targeter. And what's this pose name? Next time you do it, let's find out what this pose name is. Cause it says on the guy that this one's name's Amy, but there's no way that this one's Amy. This one's name Meg. Meg! If she splits into multiple images, you need to figure out which one's the real one. This one? <laughs> <laughs> Alright, let's go to the Yeah. All she does though is just split around though. If you wait too long though, all four of them will attack you at once. And you can don't the way you can tell though is and the reason why we're getting it the first time is because the first, the real one does a little bitty spin at the very beginning. If you notice which one spins, you got it. And there you go. <laughs> and we beat the purple po Meg, and her flame returns to the uh, altar, which causes that elevator from the very beginning that that fell that went down on us to appear. So now we can go down the elevator. To be honest with you, that's the best I've done against the Meg. Hey, yes. this is a reminiscence of uh, the scene. Legend of Zelda. <laughs> the yeah. Elevator design. Yeah. Oh. Dum, dum. Do, 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 do. And now we're in the spinner room, and there is a gold skull tola in this room, the last gold skull tola of this dungeon. All right. So the first thing to do is uh, assume, uh, there's a switch here, which uh, sounds like may unlock something, and then. And one of these also has a like said a gold skull tola, so we gotta spin it around so we can find this gold skull tola. Too, so we can grab that. I hear it. There's another switch in here. Which opens up that gate. I hear that gold skull tola somewhere. There is uh, And we get arrows. I hear the gold skull tola. Let's keep let's just keep pushing around until we get to the gold skull tola. There's another switch in here, which opens up that door, 
which is the door that we actually need to get to to get to. If you notice, there's the skull door, which means the boss is through that door. We're almost done with the forest temple, guys. But we gotta find the skull scotola first. Come on, go scotola. Well now. Okay. Yeah, I heard it. All right, when you hear it, enter the room and look on the wall on the left. So we just gotta find it. And once we hear it, just enter that room real quick and then it might be a... I thought I saw it. There it is! What is this left? This guy sucks. And that's our final gold controller for this dungeon. Now all we got left to See? do... Right there. Oh, right there, right there. So, so now all we got left to do now is get to the boss door. Oh, oh, uh, oh. Here we are, guys. The boss door. Who could it be? Who could it be? We're going to do that on the next episode. Yes. In the next episode, we go through the boss door to find out who is the boss for this temple. And we're still trying to figure out who the uh, who could be the, uh, sage. the sage of the forest temple. So, we've all figured that out on the next episode. Still, have a good day. We will see y'all next time on Let's Play The Legend of Zelda Ocarina of Time. This is DKS3A, the crazy gamer with... I can't wait. Blazing Bob. Signing out. <laughs>